Hello, 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 everyone. Thank you for tuning in. I am Jay Lee. This is Jay Lee's Corner. This is my review for episode two of Catfish Trolls. Uh, this is episode one, so this is episode two. I have to admit, I enjoyed episode two more because, I mean, it was just crazy if I ever. I mean, it was just, honey, it was just too much. Anyway, if you have not done so already, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel. And then after you've subscribed, baby, make sure that you hit the notification button that lets you know when I have posted new videos. So it is always a good thing to be knowing when the video is out, girl. So, that too. Don't forget you can also like this video or, you know what, like the video. Okay, just go ahead and hit the little like button. Thank you very much. And you can also share my videos. So, Oh, reminder, I will be live on my YouTube channel tonight at 10 p.m. So if you want to, like, you know, come to a little chat or, you know, it's going to be question and answer. It's always a fun time when I'm live with my friends on YouTube, okay, because I love all of y'all. So, yeah, tonight, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, because I'm in Michigan. So 10 p.m., my time is in Michigan. So I don't know where you at, wherever you are. When it's, <laughs> when it's 10 p.m. here, Eastern Standard Time, that's the time that you should be on here. Um, and as you, um, you, I only you want to be on there for a minute or two, but it always end up being like an hour, hour and a half because people come on and they ask questions and you know, it goes from there. Anyway, so this part two, not part two, episode two of Trolls, um, it was good, you know what I'm saying, you know, today is Saturday, it's my makeup day, so I'm like, let me do this show, I uh, missed some other little stuff, so it was, this is about Cam Yonce and Roland Ray, okay? These names, Jesus. Now, first of all, Cam Yonce has a last name of Minaj, okay? Why? Because he is a Nicki fan and I'm a Beyonce fan. Now, Roland Ray is a little Kim fan. And when I tell you this is the pettiest shit I've ever seen in life, it's the pettiest shit. And I'm a petty bitch, okay? I'm a very, very petty person. And this, I was like, Lord, what is going on here, okay? What is happening? And I think the fact that the show is hosted by Charlemagne ain't making no better because it's just honey 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 anyway um cam yonce is being trolled by roland ray they're both i guess he he did like some vine stuff okay um he made a vine video about how much he loved Nicki minaj cool whatever <coughs> first of all Y'all know I love my gays, okay? I love the gay, I love the LGBTQ. It might be another I'm missing, but don't, you know, it's it's a lot. All the letters of the alphabet, all, I love you all. Honey, but Cam Yonce, bitch. I said, oh, Lord, Jesus. he walked in, honey, and this little outfit was a little person or whatever. It had them eyebrows drawn on by I don't know who. I did not like his eyebrows, okay? His eyebrows were pointed to his ear okay i'm like bruh whoever it is it was just too much i'm all for you know what i'm saying you know if you happen to be a gay male and you you know had your face beat i don't care beat that damn face all day every day however i have very thin eyebrows so i also get how people get you know things added to their brows to make them more fuller more whatever but i'm like Somebody did not like you and didn't, bruh, I just did not like his eyebrows. I did not. I wanted someone to fix them. And I feel like when you go get your eyebrows done, they're supposed to be done. And if you wear your eyebrows natural, like I like, I have very thin brows. Um, And I'm like, I, and the reason I won't let anyone do them is because I don't want them looking foolish. Okay? And I mean, his eyebrows was a lot. Okay? There's a whole lot. But I think he's great. Anyway. I love this purse too. So yeah, he is a Nicki fan. He did some Vine videos. He says at one point he was up to like 40,000 followers or whatever. I think on Twitter. And he has like maybe 8,000 followers on Instagram. So he's, I guess he's a social media person. He do, he book parties. He do hosting gigs or whatever. I, somebody. 
Somebody need to pay me to host a goddamn gig, okay? Because if they can do it, I can damn sure do it. I am very entertaining, okay? I will get the crowd hype, honey. It'll be karaoke all day because I'm going to rap and sing every song on it. I'm getting everybody bouncing, bitch. So someone need to hire me to host some shit, okay? Because everybody hosting but my ass because I got to work. That's probably why. Anyway, so he is inst he's Vine famous. Or whatever in his town, so he's he's doing things okay if you like it. Now, see, he's been trolled by a little Kim lover, fan, super fan, I don't know, whatever, named Roland Ray, who happens to be a gentleman in a wheelchair. Okay, now he says Roland Ray has posted how he has AIDS, which messed up his brand. Okay, and because he has all these Twitter followers or whatever, it can mess up him him being booked for stuff. That's absolutely true. But no one should stop working with anyone because they have AIDS. I, I want to put that out there too. Um, but he says how Roland Ray even said how his dad died. He said he said he, he said this fool Ray said your dad died because he didn't like having a gay son with AIDS. I mean. I, <sighs> They show how, you know, Roland Ray has called him the F word. You know, the F, it starts with the F, ends with a T, and it's, it's a, one, two, three, four, five, six other row. The, the F word for, that the, the F word that's derogatory for gay people. I'm not going to say it. Anyway, but Ray is also gay. He just happens to be in a wheelchair. It's just, I cannot make this shit up. And this episode, watching this episode is what made me um, want to review the show. I Because I, I watched episode two. Before I watch episode one. And when I watch episode two, I said, bitch, okay, go back and watch episode one and, you know what I'm saying, do them both. So, for me, I'm like, you have basically a Nikki fan and a little Kim fan beefing, okay? And Nikki and little Kim don't get two shits by either one of you people. I mean, look, Nikki ain't nowhere paying none of y'all bills and neither is Kim. I refuse to be such a diehard fan of any artist's. That I'm in these streets beefing with people. Like real beef where I got to call a damn TV show to fix it. Uh, no. Not for no damn nigga. I know you look him. Because the beef on one person's side is about one artist. The beef on the other person's side is about, you know, what I can say. You know, the Ray is beefing for, for little Kim. Okay, he's standing for little Kim. Whereas the Twitter stuff that went back forth was about the artist. But then when Ray said, think about how, why... Uh, Cam Yance dad dad or whatever that is what Cam Yance pissed about and that's a valid reason to be pissed off at somebody But I also feel like this, you know people like well, they said this they said that look Let's be honest. Okay, and no offense. No tea. No shade But two gay Nikki and Lil Kim fans beefing is they gonna say some foul shit I've seen gay people argue and go back and forth and they mouth is reckless it is it will slice you to the white me baby and i feel like it doesn't make it right but i'm not surprised that these two people going back and forth is saying some mean nasty shit to each other okay at this point we only see the things that ray has been saying about cam Yance. but you can't tell me that cam Yance ain't come back at that ass with some also crazy stuff but you know what I'm saying? And you know, gay men can read. Okay. That is where the read came from. Okay. <laughs> Look, I'm like, I ain't surprised, bitch. I, not at all. Anyway, it, I know it's going to be an all out war. You can't tell me no different. So, um, but the, uh, so, neat, not enough. It's different thing. Neva Max, Charlemagne and Ray, Raymond. Because it's Raymond who was hoping host. And then Roland Ray is the, is the troll. So, they talked to Charlamagne or whatever. And it was what it was. Honey, when <laughs> they do the little uh, video thing. Like, little video commentary the, the person does. Why did Cam Yance have a whole towel wrapped on his head? I say, bitch, ain't no hair to hold in that towel, bro. Like, sis. No, no, man, no, thank you. Like, ain't no hair... He was really being, I said, Jesus, Mary and Joseph, I cannot, but I was like, ain't no hair this is. Take that towel off your damn head, bro. I, <laughs> he had it wrapped on the head. I was like, well, ain't no hair to hold. Oh, I got, I could not, I could not play with you. I'm like, not, not going to do it. Anyway, they do show, you know, Charlamagne and Raymond, um, investigate, you know what I'm saying? Going to both of the people's IG, Twitter, going all the thing. You know, they see how, um, He's trolling a lot of people. So, Roland Ray ain't just trolling Cam Yance. He's a full-out troll in these YouTube, Instagram, not YouTube, 
<laughs> that's my domain. Uh, these Twitter streets, because so, it's basically all on Twitter. Twitter, I don't be on Twitter much. I t I tweet stuff every once in a while. It's too much. I don't. I think I have maybe like a hundred subscribers or followers on Twitter. Cause I'm I don't I don't understand Twitter enough to be going back. I'm not I'm not finna argue with you people at all on Twitter. I'm not gonna do it. But their beef is Twitter stuff. So they were talking to people who we dissed. One girl said he was going back and forth with her. How he made a diss song about her. Now the diss song was a horrible diss song. It was horrible. But okay, it was the worst diss song I have ever in my life heard. Like, <sighs> some people just need to know what not to do. He should not ever do rap. Um, so, but she said, yeah, he was mean or whatever. So he was gonna do this, do that. How he was gonna roll her over with his wheelchair. I'm like, you know, you can't be using your disability to get at people. Like, you cannot be doing that at all. And he seems to be. He's also a social media person, just like Cam Yance, hosting or doing whatever. And they both kind of in the same area, so they end up skyping. They see a picture of Roland Ray with a person who's supposed to be his best friend. Okay, I'm saying, hey, best friend, that's my best friend. So Mulan skypes in and says, yes, she is Roland Ray's best friend. Um, she says how he, she, but she said even in person, he be threatening to run people over with his damn wheelchair. Bruh, you can't be doing that. This is not nice. Um, she then says that she was told by Roland Ray that Cam Yance was making fun of his wheelchair first. And that's how the beef started. But she then gives them Ray's number. This is my thing about that. I am not giving my best friend's number out to nobody, bitch. Not to nobody if that person has not told me specifically to give someone their number. You know what I'm saying? I look, I barely be I barely would give person my best friend's name. Okay, y'all know Carl my best friend because she she doesn't mind people knowing who she is but i'm like if Diva max or if charlamagne and raymond call me like i heard carla the abc do you have her phone number nope i oh, don't no. but she's a best friend i know i ain't got a number though i'm not giving you nothing like at nothing okay so the fact that this little best friend mulan was like you want his number i'm like bitch what kind of best friend is you you at least call your best friend and say hey best friend Guess who just called me? Okay. The catfish people. Do you want them to have your number? And then they have to tell me yes. She said yes to them quick if you ask me. Anyway. Um. They then see on Twitter. That Cam Yance has been saying things. About. Roland Ray. They do like a little Google search between the two of them. And it pulls up old tweets. But a lot of tweets from Roland Ray is missing. So it's like it's dialogue that's missing parts. And you know what I'm saying. So that they know that he um, did delete some stuff. But you do see Cam Yance going at him too. Like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't got no money, whatever. This is a whole back and forth thing. He do like comment about his wheelchair. He do this. I'm like, you out here balling. On, <laughs> you balling with a disability check. I'm like, bitch. I got it, Lord Jesus. So they're like, he isn't completely innocent in the whole situation. So when they do talk to Cam Yance, he says, I'm not trolling Roland Ray. I am clapping back at stuff he said to me he says i'm responding to ray to stuff ray has said to me if you come at me i'm gonna clap back all day every day so he said what i'm doing isn't trolling i'm responding to a troll there is a difference okay if someone come like people say well oh when someone comes to me you don't have to respond yes the fuck i do if i feel like and if i respond back i'm not a troll but if you troll me you might get you might get clapped back on and that's what Cam Yance is saying that he is doing. He said, "I'm not trolling him. I'm not trolling him or whatever." So he then say how um, he said, "You know, Roland Ray is the kind of person where he won't stop messing with you. He won't stop coming at you. He won't stop, you know, adding you or whatever unless you respond because trolls want attention, bitch. You don't give them attention. And at this point in time, I'm like, do they block buttons? Don't work. Like how you again? I'm not going on any TV show about somebody that I can block. Like I have the I have the the, the power." In this situation, to block a bitch, okay, block, block, boogity block, all day, every day. But he said, you know, what I'm saying, I just didn't do that yet. I'm like, the fact that y'all won't do the basic, bare minimum to stop someone from even getting at you is to me like you like the attention, okay? You like the back and forth. The back and forth gives y'all attention from from whoever else is following y'all, because it's a whole goddamn fight. Anyone know if you on Facebook or whatever? And someone posts that, and it, people is arguing on the stat. People want to, people want to see that for entertainment. So I feel like 
they both know let's not block the other one because it's giving us attention it's probably getting us more, more followers or whatever and people want to see that drama and i'm like you can't tell me no different so they then call Roland ray they call Roland ray with cam Yance sitting right there and tell him now when he answered the phone <laughs> he answered the phone being petty. You know, they're like, yeah, we called him because we're doing a show about, you know, social media people or whatever and wondering if you want me on the show. When he found out Charlemagne is there, he like, he was shedding Charlemagne. Um, wasn't you the one that got beat up or hit in the head by Lil' Kim fan? You, you know, you ain't shit. I'm like, bro, how they calling you to be on a show and you being shady to the person doing the show? I'm like, see, when that happened, the way he came at them, I said, he a petty bitch all day. He is a messy bitch all day. You can't you can't reason with certain people. When a person won't even put up a fake face and not be actual or, or not be rude or not throw shots at you from the beginning, look, ain't no winning in that fight. Ain't no winning in that fight. And I felt from the moment he said hi he answer the phone, I said, It ain't gonna be po- it's not gonna be positive. It just, it just isn't. He then said, Yeah, I'm gonna come to the show. I'll come to the show. Um, but Charlemagne, watch your toes. I said, This nigga right here. Anyway, honey, they go to a park and they meet up or whatnot. Honey, Roland Ray rolled up in that damn wheelchair, purse on his head, big ass purse on a wheelchair. Like, yes, I'm here. I'm like, bitch, what are you doing? And when he sees Cam Yance sitting there, um, because Cam Yance is something perched, okay, I'm saying perched with his purse too, you know what I'm saying? Cam Yance Minaj is sitting up there, um, and he's sitting in between Raymond and Charlemagne. Now, he rolled up, literally. Okay, he rolled up. I'm saying rolling up on six. And he called Cam Yance and Charlemagne bitch number one and bitch number two. I no broke bitch. Broke bitch number one and number two. I'm like already then? already? Okay, this gonna be good. He is still saying how the beef with Cam Yance is about look him. He out here rolling up on people about look him look him don't know that man look him don't know that man oh and the crazy thing about it was they showed on his social media pages he had photos like he had how he won prom king he was at some place with michelle michelle obama he was pictured in a photo with michelle obama meaning michelle obama went to talk somewhere and he was one of the people there probably because he's a wheelchair person or whatever and i think something something happened to him when he was little he had i forgot the disease he said that he got he had because he didn't he wasn't born he wasn't born not able to walk he just, he was he wasn't able to walk once he turned like 10 years old or whatnot anyway but again he is up here like he's mad because they dislike him i'm like he is like it's really about little kim i'm like but little kim don't know you bro at all like he even said on the phone like yeah i want to come to new york because that's what look that's little kim's mecca i said this is delusional anyway he's real life extra like extra 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 like i mean and you don't want to speak ill of the handicap however at this point i'm like someone should like break the brakes on his wheelchair he can't stop nowhere he got to run to like a damn pillow truck i don't know um this fall to the pillows but yeah he is very messy he complete. he should be called messy rolling rolling ray all day all day so um he then sound when well, you came back to me or whatever you talked about me <laughs> you said you was a damn lie that ain't, that ain't the truth you said i came after your wheelchair after you said what you said what you said about my, my dead father now again what i liked was you can tell cam yance had one point my only thing is you said something about my, my father who died and him dying you know what I'm saying affects me still so my only issue is that what you said about my father i don't care about any other, any other bullshit whereas Roland ray is still petty I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Look him. Look him. Look him. I'm like, this is kind of crazy. So, Roland Ray. What did I write? No. When Cam Yonce said he wants an apology for what he said about his father, Roland Ray replied, said, well, I want an apology from, from Charlemagne. I'm like, this ain't even about Charlemagne. And he, Charlemagne laughed because Charlemagne could tell it was some bullshit and what another gonna be resolved. Charlamagne could tell that and so could Cam Yance. However, Raymond, who was just uh, oh my god, you guys, let's just calm down. Like let's just talk about these things. Like let's let's forget re- remember the reason we're here. See, that's what something you can't have some people at the cookout because they don't know what the fuck to do. Raymond at this cookout with these three black folk, he don't know what to do. Okay, he's the white guy in the corner 
thinking about um where's the potato salad like it's just a, he he just out of his element he don't know what's going on around here anyway he says to Charlamagne I want an apology for you because you um bleach your skin and no one in media like you you talk about love him I'm like again he is being completely negative 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 and um Cam, you know, I said, like, bitch, don't play with me, you know where I'm from, uh, don't play with me, whatever, it was a whole crazy situation, um, a producer, like, like, you know what, let's stop, let's separate y'all, like, Raymond, you talk to, to Roland Ray, Charlamagne, you and Cam, you say, come over here, whatever, let them talk real quick, so, again, Raymond is trying to be, oh, my God, so, what's wrong, what happened to you, you always realize, what happened, he's trying to sympathize with Ray, excuse me y'all and figure out why is he being this way i can tell because that's who he is okay that's who he that's who he is he's i was not born this way i was bullied when i was younger um i then was you know got this disease when i was like 10 years old i ended up in the wheelchair he like so um if i i felt like if i couldn't fight with my hands I will fight my words, but I say stuff to, you know what I'm saying, to hurt people. So he's admitting he know what he's doing. He doing it on purpose, and it's a whole bunch of bullshit. You know, he then said, well, I'm open to work with the I said, maybe we can like, work together, whatever. I'm like, he lying. Like, he lying, and Raymond don't get it. So, you know, Ray, like, it's a better way to be in life. He's like, I know. He's like, you know, bring it back over here. I'm like, this is going to be a trick. It's a goddamn trick. You know, when he go over to talk to Cam Yance and, and Charlamagne, Cam Yance, he gave you a, a sad story. He And you fell for it. Like, he needed somebody on the side. He picked you. Meaning, he played you and you don't see it. And Charlamagne said, yep, I see it, bitch. What? What? Because he did. He picked the easy target to feel for him even though he was not being genuine. So, they go back and sit down. And sure enough, Ray is being mean and evil whatever. Saying how Cam Young saying shit, he ain't gonna change his, his thought, thoughts about it or whatever. So, you know, at that point in time, you know, Cam Young got tired of Ray's tongue hanging out of his mouth, and yes, because he's a big tongue. And he just, you know, he 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 throws the water on it. You know, he throws the water on the tongue. The water happened to get everywhere else. He threw a whole, he threw a whole little thing, thing water on that man. I mean, a whole little, <laughs> gave a whole shower. I and the funny part was, Roland Ray was so shocked. That he did it because it happened real quick. He was so shocked because the water came so fast, and he was just like, oh, "Okay." And I was like, "I don't give a fuck. I don't care what y'all say. I don't care if y'all think it's wrong. I did it. I don't care." And I, it was funny because I was like, "When you put out negativity, that is what you get back." Okay, Roland Ray came to that meeting negative. He rolled up negative. He rolled away negative. It was a whole negative vibe. And Cam Yance for the most part. He held his composure. I think he got tired of the bullshit and tired of the fuck shit. And he said, you know what? I'm over the shit. Wish wash, wish wash. Here's a goddamn shower. And he kind of just walks away. Now, Charlemagne, Charlemagne was like, oh, okay, that's kind of crazy. So, um, I'm just like, I'm not surprised. Not surprised at all. You know, rolling away rolls, rolls away or whatever. You know, <laughs> can't be honest. Like, we in the same city. Catch me, bitch. And I'm like, well, okay. Raymond is upset. Like, I can't believe it. What's this? Well, like, this is not the way to handle things. And Charlemagne had the most logical response. He's like, you he said, you know, um, I'm not about what happened either. You know, I don't think throwing the water was cool or whatnot. He says, but, um, I'm not about condoning people who are negative. You know, life gives you what you get it. So, you know, he, Roland Ray got what he put out. And that's what it was. And he was like, you know what I'm saying? Um, he's just, ne he's negative. And, because like, I felt like Raymond wanted to coddle Roland Ray. And that's why Charlamagne's like, I, I can't coddle people who, you know, do that kind of thing. I can't do that. Because, again, he don't want to be helped. He want to be this mean, nasty person. And it is what it is. So, at this point in time, Ray was like, I was bullied when I was younger. I was bullied at 5, at 10, or whatever. And don't nobody know what that feel like. And Charlamagne says, so you feel like because you was bullied, it, it gives you the right to, to, you know, be a troll? Like, that's not true. He says, you know what I'm saying? Um, until you change your attitude, things will keep happening. You're bullying people now nah, because you're bullied. And you can't say stuff and think no one will come back at you. It was completely true. Even somehow, you know what I'm saying? Uh, what did he say? What did he say? Oh, you have to have, the, uh, you have, to have a, a, a balance of righteousness and ratchetness. And right now, you are ratchet. This fool rolled away, so you know what? And scene. I'm out, and he rolled away. 
honey completely rolled the fuck away. Um, they tell Cam Yance how he date, you know, well, no, Ray does. Raymond says, I wasn't happy. Cam Yance, how you threw water on him. He said, well, it was what it was. I'm going to block him, and he blocked him. This episode was extra bitch. It was very extra bitch. Cam Yance, uh, personality was extra Rolling Way, Rolling Ray was completely messy, petty, I can't deal with it at all kind of person. Um, but once he blocked him on social media, it was fine. And it was like three months later, they both hadn't talked. They both had moved on. Um, at the end, Rolling Ray said how he learned his lesson, how he's not going to be that way anymore. And he only going to be about positive things. And hopefully, you know, Cam Yance can forgive him, they can talk. Nah, bro. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on, shame on me. And I ain't gonna do it. So, it was a good episode, but I was just like, he was really, literally a Lil' Kim fan and a Nicki Minaj fan beefing for no reason on on Ray's side. I do feel like, I do get why Cam Yance was pissed off. You can't be talking about people dead parents. That shit don't work in these streets, man. You can't do that. And that was the whole episode. Peace.